Hello everybody, Jesse Dexter here. Welcome back to some more Juiced 2. Last time we did uh, the Drift event at the beginning, the championship. Got that one done. And then I did uh, the London Last Man Standing Race that I had to do twice because I stupidly hit a wall. And I bought a new car to do the prototype showdown because a Apparently, you can't um, you can't do this without uh, a car that's in the max league that you're currently in. So I had to buy a front wheel drive. I did so with the Honda Civic Type R with with the max league four, and then I got the engine prototype, power prototype on, and then la da da. You know what happened there. So now we're gonna go to and drift endurance and then I'm going to get that which I will do in this so I would have preferred if we went to Snow Widow or one of the snow tracks but I should be able to do it here just fine so let's do it I'm not gonna use the Civic Type R though although it does give you more power there's the Sylvia S15 which I will use in the next rear wheel drive. Um, no, that would be the mus that would be a muscle car. So league two will be rear wheel drive. Oh wow. I won't be able to then, cause uh league two would be the next rear wheel, which I would use a muscle car. And then League One, World Class, and then Hin Elite. I'm I'm using the BMW M3 GTR for the final one, so I wouldn't really have much of a use for a Nissan. If this was four-wheel drive, then I would definitely use it, but I can't with this. So I'm I'm actually going to, I'm still gonna use a Nissan, but I'm not gonna be using this one. I'm gonna be using a four-wheel drive Nissan, which would honestly be the Skyline. So there's that. So I might have to sell this. Maybe not though. I have lots of money anyway. Okay, um, I'm gonna use the SRT4 for this one, so let's go. This car was uh, made for um, League 4. The only thing that I couldn't use it for was the stinking prototype showdown pink slip. But yeah, we got it straightened out though. Okay, hopefully I can actually do this. I should be able to do this just fine though. Once I get to 1.5 mil, I'm gonna cut the video and then uh, I will see you when I get up to 8 or 9 million. Up there. Once I get past 8 million, then I'll show the finish of it and then I should be good after that. So yeah, let's go. Rolling start. Ready. Go! Really trying to focus here. Don't hit the wall. And I can't lose much speed either. If I hit a wall, then I'm gonna lose because you lose half of your score. So once I get past three, three million. 
and I hit a wall, then I should still be good. I am still going strong. I can probably just get 10 million right here in this event. I should probably do that just so I'll actually claim it at the end of this uh, event here. So I don't have to do another drift event. So I'm going to get to 9... Um, well, actually, the last time I saw the uh, accumulation points where we currently were, it was almost at 1 million, 982,000 or something like that. So I could just go to 9.5 mil here and be fine. But I'll uh, go to 10 million just because. And this is going to front wheel drive car. It can easily be done, um, as long as you can control the speed, keep the speed up as much as possible, and go on an easy drift course like Battle Royale, or Snow Widow, or the, any of the snow tracks, um, you'll have uh, an easy time, even with front wheel and all wheel drive, or four wheel in this game. To be able to uh, get up to 10 million or more. There we go, 10 million. I'll complete this lap and then we'll be done there. We, already, we also uh, claimed a lot of chain drifts here, so I'm over at, I'm right at 128 so far. 129. And 130. There we go. Whew. I'm already up to 12 minutes right now. But yeah, we got the 1.5 mil there. And we should have the 10 million accumulated, accumulated score done as well. So, unless I just missed it. There it is. Okay. Whew. That took a little time to do, but I got I got it. All right, so now we can go to a muscle car and do that. Well, I don't have to buy a muscle car. I can just use the one we currently have that I won from Bobby. Mm -hmm. So yeah, um, it's in the Celine, so let's do that. And yeah, it looks pretty good too. Nice little, nice looking flame job there. I'm gonna unlock the prototype. Um, actually, no, I'm gonna hold off on that. Um, well, I can't do it here anyway. Um, do I wanna customize this car at all? Or I think we can just leave it the way it is. It looks good as it is, so. Uh, I'll do, I will up the performance though. So let's uh, do the, um, beat car challenge. I will have to get quite a bit of nitrous here, but the Mustang should, uh... Sharpen your senses at divine reflex. I should be able to, uh, do this. Um, he's gonna Pagani Zonda Roadster, so... Maybe I should've used my, uh, Dodge Neon or the M3 GTR, the faster cars. I probably should have used a faster car for this. Okay, come on. That was too much. That was too much. Keep him behind me. 
I said keep him back. Finally, Jesus. Car one put some glass in its slide. Stupid idiot. He is a major cheater. You need a lot of nitrous that you can get for that one, because that one is stupid. Wow. I got the level three for that. Screw that. Just screw that. That guy can just go screw himself. That is that is not worth the time. Just don't just don't do it. Just forget about it. That is just annoying like hell. Wow. If I try to do it over and over, I'm just gonna be there all day, so it's no point. Um I was gonna use the muscle car. So let's get that over. Um, level three for that. Okay. And I'll just go level two because there's really no stinking point. Okay. I don't think I need extreme nitro for this, so we'll forget about that. All right. Two more events to do, so let's do the muscle car eliminator. What? You need a muscle car in this league to enter the race. I have a mu- Does the Celine Mustang not count as a muscle car? Are you serious? What? It's a must. It's a Mustang. Oh my God, Bobby, get out of here with that bull crap. That is stupid. Next time, have an actual muscle car, okay? Jesus. Have all the fucking. All right, I'm gonna use the Camaro then. Hell uh, yeah. I'm not gonna go through the list and pick and choose what muscle car I would have liked to use. I'm just gonna use this and go on with it. Um, Cause I don't have a lot of time to pick and choose. So, okay. Um, let's get the performance on first. I'll do a little customization after that and then uh, we'll go from there. Okay, we got our Camaro. Let's do this. Let's actually go into the uh, muscle car event. All right, exit pressure, 20k, 12.5 kilometers, or 22,000 for 20 kilometers. San Frantic. Although this one we can beat the second goal for this one, so I'll do this one then. It's not over yet. Time to go back to exit pressure. It's no walk in the park. Welcome to another kick-ass run at Circuit Eliminator. Alrighty. We're in the Camaro. He's in the Gran Torino. He, she is in the Camaro. Z28. Keiko is in the Corvette. Tyrone is in the Camaro Z28. And Nicholas is in the Pontiac Barbet. Oh my god. Alright. Let's go. Oh my god. Alright, fine. 57. Alright. You're on. This race will give them a good show. 
Okay. It's your money that you're gonna lose. So you might as well give it to me now. All right, I got a spook Keiko here. Will you get off my car? You idiot. How about I spook you instead? There you go, now get out of my way. Well, no, I don't have to spook Keiko. I just have to beat her in this event. But I also need to win this Eliminator event too, so. Oh wow. Oh come on. Get off my car. Get come on car move. Oh my god car. Kaiko is eliminated. Awesome. So that goal will be cleared no matter what place I am that I finish in right now. But I'm not planning on losing this event due to the stupidity of Ken right there. You know what? I'm just. Oh my god, Ken, what the hell? Come on, car, move. Move, car! Move! No, you're not gonna pass me, Tyrone. There you go. Okay. Crystal, go up. Ken, go up. Go away. It's my race to win. Ow. I probably should have grabbed a uh, higher class muscle car, but I just went with this one just for the hell of it. So far it's working quite well, but uh, I don't know, Ken is uh, doing pretty good. I don't like it. Oh, Ken should have been the one eliminated. Come on, game. Go away, Ken. Nobody likes you. Oh, wow. Crystal almost crashed herself back there. Alright. Come on, Crystal. Get ahead of Ken. If you can do that, then we'll... Whoa. Come on. Crystal, you gotta beat him. Oh, come on. I didn't tell you to lose. Ah. Crystal, you gotta drive better. <sighs> well, I'm, I'm quite a distance away from Ken, so... Ow. I should be fine. Go away. Ow. There we go. Win a muscle car eliminator and beat Kaiko. Alright, now we can actually do the stinking son of a promotion event and go on from there. Twenty K for that event. And then hundred and fourteen thousand for that. Awesome. And we get a prototype mod as well, so that's awesome. Cool. I am still salty about the stupid Driver X crap in that uh, beat car race in the performance area. That was just ridiculous. Okay. Promotion event is now unlocked. And yeah, let's go do it. We don't need any prototypes, 
mods or endurance uh extreme nitrous mods so yeah we're good here 180k oh my god i think we're definitely gonna reach a million for this uh playthrough here so that would be nice and i think uh for xbox and maybe playstation uh getting a million in korea is an achievement slash trophy so i think uh we'll be able to see it in this uh, playthrough so yeah um let's do it uh yeah obviously i have to use this all right we're back here at battle royale but it's a good drift track so I used a front wheel drive car to get 10 million points. It is not hard to drift in the Xbox 360 or PS3 version. It might be a little bit harder in the PS2 version, but I'll have to get the copy of the game to find out for myself. But a long time ago, when I did play it on the PS2, I remember having a bit of difficulty on the drifting in the PS2 version, especially when I was at League 2 because there was a drift event in League 2 that I couldn't actually beat in the PS2 version, so um, Where the hell is Leon? He is not there <laughs> He's not there, so he immediately forfeits the event <laughs> Wow all right, hi Kaiko, you're in a Corvette Stingray, same as Crystal, Ken is in a Camaro, the same car, but he's there, unlike Leon, and Tower is in a Corvette Stingray. Interesting. All right, Leon is not there, so he got a manatee out, right? No? You're gonna let him race, even as a ghost? Okay then. Okay, so this is Drift King, so we just have to get the most points it's not not too hard to do whoa I got a little used to driving the uh, front wheel drive car the rear wheel drive has uh, a lot more sliding in it so you gotta be careful of the speed going around corners whoa oh my god I think I probably would have had a little more trouble getting to 10 million points in a rear wheel drive car because of what's happening so far. Ken! Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> oh, I got a little word there. I thought I was going to lose. <laughs> Whew. I was able to get it, so that's awesome. Leon, he showed up. Stupid. Okay. <laughs> All right. That was short. We got a lot of money out of it, though. That's nice. Okay. And we win at a Drift King event, so we got another goal completed, even though we didn't need to do that. Alrighty, so League 4 is finally done. <sighs> Next is League 3, and I don't know what car we're going to use. It's going to be all-wheel drive, and it's probably going to be Nissan. I don't know. So let's see what we got. Alright, 71 is... Oh, we got 8 new cars for League 3. Alrighty then, because 71 is the M3 GTR, so let's see. Lotus Allege, I mean what? <laughs> Lotus Allege is a nice looking orange car here. Little nice little sports car, it's tiny as hell though, but great handling. So, Dodge Charger RT, I could probably use this car for the next rear wheel drive uh, league that I do. So for league, uh, because I'm going to use four-wheel drive for League 3 and then wheel-wheel drive again. 
Are we gonna use a muscle car? And maybe I'll use this one, Dodge Charger. Okay, that's pretty good. There's the Dodge Charger RT, which should classify as muscle, but apparently not in this game. It's a 5.7 V8, in Elite. All right. Oh, there's the Mustang Fastback. Like the car used in the Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift. Aston Martin DB9 Balancer. Ooh. Corvette Z51. Oh, there's another muscle car that I could use. My god. Nope. Apparently not muscle because this is your supercar. So that's uh, out of the question. Oh, Pontiac GTO Judge. Okay. This is also another choice. Uh, Corvette Z06. Another supercar. And that's it. No all-wheel drive, really? Or four-wheel drive? None. Oh, okay. What's the latest four-wheel drive car then? Uh, yum yum. The Subaru Impreza WRX STI. Cause apparently this is only available up to League One, so it would make more sense here. And then I could use the Nissan Skyline or any other four-wheel drive car that will be available to use in World Class. So, like, no, I can't use that because I've already used Mitsubishi. Um, yeah, the Skyline GTR is basically the only one I could use. I will do that then. I'll use the Nissan Skyline GTR R34 for um, le uh, World Class League. And then I'll use this one for this next league right here. So this has been Jesse Dexty. Hope you enjoyed. I will see you next time for League 3 when we use the Subaru FTI. Later.